Uh, gamers are packing into the Tokyo Game Show, one of the world's biggest. This year's event kicked off with a record 480 companies showing their latest gear. NHK World's Yuko Fukushima has more. One of the hottest items this year is the virtual reality headset. Sony Computer Entertainment has renamed its test model and is hoping to have it on the market next year. There are a lot of products that allow people to enjoy virtual reality. I think 2016 will be the first virtual reality year. Small businesses are also entering the fray. This company has taken VR technology to the next stage. It layers an animated character over real-time images shot with a camera attached to this robot. The player's hand movements are picked up by infrared rays in the headset. Hey, you got it! This virtual reality environment accommodates multiple viewers. The images are projected onto a half-dome ceiling. We projected that the market for virtual reality would expand. We want to get a share of that market. Let's Play Gaming is another major attraction. It allows gamers to live stream or upload a video online demonstrating their play with narration. Players often talk about and show off their strategies and techniques. There's already a collection of goods that support Let's Play Gaming. For example, this headset frees your hand so you can concentrate on the game. And of course, there's a camera. And actually, this whole computer set is for Let's Play Gaming. This accessories maker says sales of goods for gamers who want to broadcast how they play are up 30% worldwide. Gamers choose products the way professional athletes choose their shoes and other gear. I think the business will grow. YouTube and Amazon have joined the show for the first time. Amazon last year acquired the video game site Twitch, the world's largest platform for Let's Play. Amazon officials say there's big demand for games that nobody can ignore. We saw that live streaming was becoming uh, a great way for developers and players, gamers, to interact with one another. We saw that this was uh, a big up-and-coming space uh, that was brand new on the scene. Entertainment goods are becoming more diverse with increasing use of the Internet, and game makers are facing tougher competition to stay on top. Yuko Fukushima, NHK World.